What's up everybody, my name is Lawrence Ryan. In this video, we're gonna talk about a YouTube metric that's one of the most overlooked, yet one of the most important when you're trying to build your YouTube channel. And that is knowing what videos of the ones you're making are attracting the most subscribers to your channel. And I'm gonna show you how to find those coming right up. Okay, before we start, please don't forget to subscribe and or follow. Hit that bell for notifications so you get informed when new videos and premieres are coming out. Click on the like button and leave me a comment down below. Very important. All right, so knowing what videos are the ones that are resonating with your viewers is extremely important when you're trying to build your YouTube channel. If you're just starting out, it can help to define a niche for you to follow. And if you're already building your channel, it can help you to find, if I may coin a phrase, a possible sub-niche that you could branch off into to help build your channel. And it can also help you to find ideas for the videos you want to do next. Okay, So when you are starting out and you only have a few videos, it's real easy to find the videos that are attracting the subscribers to your channel. You just go from your YouTube Studio dashboard page to content. And from there, you want to go to the video in question. We'll just pick this one here. And you want to click on the analytics icon for that video. And from there, you'll see on the right hand side of the page the subscriber count for that video. And as I said, if you only have a few videos, it's pretty easy to keep track of that subscriber count change. The problem occurs when you have a lot of videos. Say, for example, you had 40, 50, or even 100 videos. Then going through each one individually to check the subscriber change can be extremely tedious and time consuming, not to mention inaccurate. But fear not, there's a way to avoid all that and this is how you do it. From your YouTube Studio dashboard, you wanna to go to analytics. And this is your channel analytics, not your video analytics. And up on the right hand side, you wanna click on advanced mode. And that opens up your views by video page, which is very cool and very important. And from there, you want to go to the left hand side drop down menu and click on subscribers. And this is what we want to see. This page shows you the videos that brought in the subscribers to your channel and the date on which those people subscribed. All the videos are color coded to help you see any changes and any patterns there. And this is set for a time period of 28 days. So let's go over to this first video. This first video is represented by a salmon color. This is the Funny Turkeys, Wild Turkeys Visit a Strip Mall that I did. And uh, so this video got two subscribers it is showing on April 1st, on that date, which is interesting because that's when I did the promotion for that video. This next purple color represents the video, which is Premiere Pro CC not showing video on timeline. And on this date, it got two subscribers. On the next date, it got one. And on the next date, it got one. So that's really cool. This yellow color represents the Battle Night RPG video I did. And that got one subscriber on that date. And then over here, the, the uh, video represented by the purple color, that got three subscribers on this day. And on the same date, the Battle Night video got one subscriber. So you can see how that works going forward there. So let's get a broader view. Let's go up and change this to 90 days. And this gives you the videos that brought in the subscribers to your channel over the 90 day period. And it looks like the video represented by the purple color here did quite well earlier in this period. But as we move forward, we can see that changes a little bit. And this is the turkey video I just mentioned. This looks like, yeah, this, this is the promotion I did for the turkey video. That seems to have done okay. And then you can note the changes going forward there. All in all, it looks like there is a pattern in the video that seems to have brought in the most subscribers is the one represented by the purple color here. So scrolling down, you can see the list view of what is above. All your videos are on the left-hand side and these are color coded as well. You get the views here, you get watch time, full subscriber count, uh, estimated revenue, impressions, and impressions click-through rate. Very good information. So clearly, this metric can provide valuable information that you otherwise might not have. 
It can show you what videos of the ones you're making are resonating with your viewers over a specified period of time. It can also help you see if your promotions are working out, if they're being effective. And I think also it can help you make some decisions as to which direction you want to take your channel, whether you want to stay in the same direction, branch off into a sub niche, or pivot to a new direction altogether. All in all, probably one of the most, if not the most valuable metric when you're trying to build your YouTube channel. Okay, that's it for this video. Hope you found it helpful. Once again, don't forget to subscribe and or follow. Click on the like button, leave me a comment down below. This is Lawrence Ryan, and I'll see you in the next one.